here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. Fixing and fixing and all his reindeers blowing on the range. Bells are ringing, children singing all. What's up, YouTube? It's Mike Lee, and welcome back to my channel. So, I know I look crazy. Today, I'm gonna show you guys how I basically take out my braids, wash my hair, and prep my hair for when I wear my wig. So, this is like a natural hair care video, like basically what I do in between getting my braids done for my wigs. Y'all, look at my hair. He needs some milk. <laughs> like, these braids in my hair right now, like I've kept them in for way too long. I don't normally keep them in like for this long. I didn't really have time to get my hair done. So I was just leaving the braids in and just like putting new wigs and stuff on it. And it's just like mad build up product and stuff like all in my edges and stuff. So yeah, this is basically just like a full wig prep of like what I do with my natural hair. I look so crazy right now. Like this is embarrassing. I'm gonna just speed these clips up of me taking out my braids. Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a like chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced So no one else can do That's why I'm not my love Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a like chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced So no one else can make you do That's why I'm not spend my life with you Alright, so as y'all saw, I just finished taking out my braids or whatever. So this is my natural hair, looking crazy. I think before she, the girl who braided my hair, um, braided it. I think my hair was straight. So I haven't washed my hair since I got that washing set, which was literally like a month and a half ago. I'm about to wash my hair right now. I also can't even do my full routine right now because it's 6:30 and I have to be on camp for practice at like 8:30. So I only have two hours or whatever. So I'm probably gonna take like an hour to wash my hair and then I have to leave. So <laughs> these are. 
are all the products that I'm about to use. Most of this stuff is I use after I wash my hair, but to wash my hair, I'm gonna use this shampoo. Um, I can't find my other shampoo. This is just some shampoo that my dad bought me. Never used it before, but we are gonna try that. So I'm gonna wash my hair, put some of this hair mask on it, and let it like sit for a couple of minutes or whatever, probably like 10, 15 minutes. Then rinse that out, and then go in with this conditioner. It's a leave-in conditioner, so I'm gonna leave this in my hair. After I brush my hair out and like detangle everything, I know my hair is gonna be like frizzy. Like my curls is not gonna be defined. And I don't really care to have my curls defined right now because when I come back, I'm honestly just gonna blow dry my hair. Okay, I wanna blow dry my hair now, but I know I'm not gonna have enough time to do all of that. So I'm gonna just use all these products just so my hair, you know, has like all the nutrients and the moisture that it needs because my hair be mad dry in the winter and I know it's about to start getting cold outside. So oh yeah, and the products are forgot to tell y'all <laughs> herbal essences, yeah, repair argan oil of Morocco. That's a shampoo that I'm using. Hair mask that I'm using is the main choice. Herbal hair tonic and soy milk deep hydration mask. I need this because my hair needs some hydration. Like, And I just I just trim my ends. I definitely forgot I trim my ends. So my hair should be healthy. And then the leave-in conditioner that I'm using is the main choice. I, the main choice is like my favorite natural hairline. This is the anti-breakage and repair antidote oil. Cuticle control leave-in lotion. So yeah, my hair is like kind of prone to breakage. I don't like that. And my hair is actually growing. Like, bro. Let's really I already saw. I don't know what kind of brush this is called, but this really helps detangle my hair so easily. Like, I love this brush. So, yeah, I'll be back. All right, so just finished washing my hair, whatever. I literally just detangled it and put it into two little buns or whatever. This is what it's given right now. I'm gonna leave it out like this while I go to practice. How much time is it? 7.43. Yo, my hair is growing. But what I'm gonna do right now, I'm just gonna spray it with this Restore Spray by The Main Choice. It's sweet oil and honey endless moisture. Just so my hair, you know, got some moisture. My hair needs to be moisturized. Basically, like, that's why I'm adding all these products with matte moisture and stuff, because I I hate when my hair is dry and when your hair is dry it's more prone to break it so this is literally what I do every time I take my braids out and wash it and then put braids right back in that's really why my hair is growing so much cuz I'm doing all of this and then I put it right back into braids like trim it every now and then the only thing I'm gonna say about wigs is that one I feel like my curl pattern is not as defined since my hair being braids all the time like my hair is not used to being curly so that's one thing about wigs and two my hairline is not as thick as it used to be like you can literally see how thin my edges are I hate that they're not OD thin but they're thinner than what they should be like look at the rest of my hair and then look at my edges like bro my hair is mad thick my edges should not look like that I use the main choice growth oil bro this I I stopped using this and I feel like that's why my hair hasn't like grown like OD OD since like the last time I like, did a limb check. But when I used to use this every day during quarantine last year, bro, my hair was growing like, so I'm gonna start using this again. It's just hard to do it when I have wigs in cause like, how am I gonna put oil in my scalp with the wig on? Whenever I change from like one wig to another is when I'm gonna like really put like a lot of this in my hair. This really makes my hair grow so fast. If I just use this on my edges like probably for like a month, my edges would be perfectly fine. Like right back to how they were. So that's why I'm not really worried about my edges like yeah they look a little thin but if I really wanted to stop wearing wigs for a while and just have my hair just grow I could do that so I'm not really stressing it I put that all throughout my scalp when I tell y'all it makes your hair grow like if you're looking to retain length and just have your hair grow fast well it works for my hair and everybody says it works for their hair it should work for your hair so look into the main choice growth oil if look at how good my hair is ever since I started using the main choice like my hair has been so help I love my hair now next step <laughs> it's like a whole process. I'm using the main choice ancient Egyptian anti breakage and repair and adult split end treatment serum. So I just use this all throughout my ends. This is like to prevent split ends and stuff. And when I tell y'all, like, I need this, this barely comes out when you like squeeze it. So I'll be putting mad pumps, like, mad pumps. I put this on like from here down because like your split ends can always rise up so I don't want to just put it on like the tip of my hair like I'm gonna put it on like the bottom half this be playing the only thing I don't like about this it really be like I'll be struggling to, to get it out like to I'm about to get real good on we're gonna do this period <laughs> I'm about to use the um, Cantu Coconut Oil Shine and Hold Mist. This is literally just for, like it says, shine and hold. I'm not holding anything, but I need some shine and some... You can never go wrong with some more moisture, so... There's this other Cantu spray that I normally use when I'm doing a wash and go. The Comeback Curl thing, I don't have it right now, but that really makes my curls mad defined. This is the Heavenly Halo Herbal Hair Tonic Soy Milk Deep Hydration Softening Milk. So this makes my hair soft and easy to just manage. So I'm using like this much. 
spread it down my fingers well hands and then just you know and i really try to get from root to end like every part of my hair matters and i'm just gonna go in and brush the ends out because that's the only thing about brushing out my hair when i brush it out my curls don't be defined but it be like detangled so i don't know how people be brushing out the hair and have their hair still defined now let me do this side and i'll come back all right so my hair is fully moisturized now by the time i get back my hair probably will be dry so i'm just gonna like re-wet it before i blow dry it a little bit and detangle it i'm gonna see if i can have one of my friends braid my hair tomorrow but until then i'm gonna just be freestyling all right y'all so this is my hair right now crazy i know i just wet this a little bit i'm about to fill my um about to fill my water bottle back up because it's empty but i'm about to blow dry my hair y'all look at my hair right now i just want to show y'all the shrinkage is crazy and don't mind this y'all i just got my second dose for my vaccine Working on a weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hit the block up, I tell you if it was us. Man, a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush. Say my day's a number, but I keep waking up. No, you see my text, baby, please say something. Wine by the glass, man, a cheapskate, huh? Niggas gotta move on my release day, huh? Bitch, this is fame, not clout. I don't even know what that's about. Watch your mouth. Maybe got an ego twice the size of the crib. I can never tell the shit it is what it is. Said what I had to and did what I did. Never turn my back on every G, God forbid. Heard you got the paddock on my wrist, doing front flips. Giving you my number, but don't hit me on no dumb shit. Working on the weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist, going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hit the block up, I tell you if it was us. In a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush. It's cool, man. Got red bottles on. Life is good. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I just finished blow drying the last piece. But yeah, so this is what it's given right now. My hair be going through stages, y'all. I'm literally a whole different person with natural hair. Like, natural hair me is not the same person as Micah with a wig, okay? But she's giving inches. I'm gonna go through this one more time, and I'm done. Well, done blow drying. That all right so that's it for blow drying my hair i'm about to oil my scalp with my goat oil y'all already know y'all should know by now the goat oil baby every day i gotta use this i really want my hair to grow girl like literally how i got this length is from this without this my hair would not be this long and i'm about to start using it so it could grow even more because i feel like my hair is not as long as i want it to be i need my hair to be waist length like i need my hair to be down to my ass so i mean like two more years i want to see how long my hair is gonna be when i graduate yeah i just gotta keep maintaining the health and the length and the I just gotta really keep trimming my hair. As long as I trim my hair, I should be good. I just trimmed my hair like mid-August or whatever. So put that oil on my scalp and then massage it in. When you like massage your scalp, it like stimulates hair growth. So I'm gonna get my hair braided tomorrow. I don't feel like doing my own hair or like braiding my own hair. I definitely can, especially since I have no nails on, but it's not really giving that. So I wanna do a style. Like I feel like I'm always having wigs. Like I never do nothing to my natural hair, but I'm dead gonna start doing my natural hair i want to get the length that i want right now i'm just letting it let it rock i don't want to do a ponytail i want to do some knotless braids forehead is mad big like i never really had a problem with my forehead before i started wearing wigs but now it's like i'm so used to how i look with wigs all right y'all today's the next day i'm about to go get my hair braided i'm not gonna record me braiding my hair because it's literally just straight back but... 